Hey guys, today's on Schizophrenia and Eric Erickson. Schizophrenia and Erickson, but before we get to Mr. Erickson, please allow my brief prelude. As you know, I conveniently recorded it for our mutual comfort, our mutual convenience, and our mutual luxury. And hey, listen, I'm no spring chicken, and I've been around a few preludes in my years. I'm telling you, this kid, this prelude, it's got something that's particularly luxurious. Kind of like a, uh, an open cornfield. Hello there, my name is Robert Francis. You've stumbled on my Unconquering Schizophrenia YouTube channel. Where me and the bird. That's my keys are right. That's right, that's right. We talk schizophrenia. This is the cut of my jib right here for reasons of my medical confidentiality. My jib. I'm a licensed clinical social worker times 15 years. Indeed, indeed. That's a lot of gabbing and chatting. Too much. I've been diagnosed with schizophrenia for a score five and one. And that puts a little gray fleck in my beard. Advancing down the jib. Thank you for joining me on my channel. Now to topic, to topic, to topic. Eric Erickson was a developmental psychologist, and he, uh, he put forth the theory of five different stages in life. And the last one, he, uh, when people were uh, in their elder years, was the framework of the spectrum of integrity versus despair. Do people move towards psychological integrity, or do they fall into the pit of despair? When people are uh, on approaching, uh, approaching perhaps their mortality, he framed this integrity versus despair as the final psychological crisis to overcome. So if you know you're sick and you're dying and uh, it becomes, do you stay integral? Do you stay psychologically integral together or do you fall into the pit of despair? And... Uh, this pertains to schizophrenia as well, beyond any issues of mortality. Do we, given schizophrenia, given this, the, um, given the um, product of schizophrenia, do we stay psychologically integrated and together, or do we fall into the pit of despair? And it's a spectrum, of course. Integrity, psychological integrity is keeping it together. And then on the opposite end of the spectrum is abject dis despair. And of course, we move across this back and forth. Sometimes we feel we, like we got it together. Other times we feel like we're in despair. But please know of the spectrum of despair and the fact that staying psychologically together is the goal. Kudos to Eric Erickson on that. That was uh, great. He has five developmental stages. Integrity versus despair is the final stage, but it pertains to schizophrenia. Open cornfield, a lot of cornfields where I live. I'm uh, out in the country, and there's nothing like an open cornfield. All right, guys, have an ear. Stay uh, integrated, and we'll see you next time. Thanks.